All right, Stephanie, thank you very much. Turning now to the state of the Capitol, the new year means new pay for many Arkansans. A minimum wage increase is one of many changes to come in 2019. Fox 16's Jesse Tenor joining us at the Capitol with a look at January's calendar. Jesse. Yeah, Kevin, the state wage increase goes into effect tomorrow, and then after that, there are several other dates that we're keeping an eye on. January 9th is when the state should announce who is going to be able to sell medical marijuana, and then state lawmakers convene at the Capitol January 14th. In 2018, Arkansas voters gave minimum wage employees a raise. These are our cheap stud finders. The first boost kicks in the first day of 2019, from 850 to 925 an hour. Some workers that will help voted against the measure. I'm worried about price increases on stuff, but my bosses here have assured me that it's not going to be a very drastic change. While some businesses the increase could hurt voted for it. I know how difficult it is for parents to put food on the table and also pay child care. During the second week of 2019, the state should announce which 32 companies will get a license to sell medical marijuana. More than two years after Arkansas voters approved it. That puts us somewhere in April. The five companies chosen to grow the product have promised to be ready by spring or summer. In the third week of January, the Arkansas legislature's regular session starts to consider a slew of bills including one on local control of casinos. Arkansas voters expanded gaming in 2018, paving the way for two new casinos in Jefferson and Pope counties. People need to get to work here. <laughs> you know, uh, my children need jobs. Jefferson County is willing to take a gamble on the new business, while Pope County is trying to reduce the odds of a casino in its backyard. They can dream. Just because there's a picture on Facebook doesn't mean it's going to get built. All setting the stage. For an eventful 2019. And according to the Tax Foundation, tax relief legislation for low income Arkansans also goes into effect tomorrow. Live at the state capitol, I'm Jesse Tenor. Stay with us. We're back after a quick break.